Hey, welcome back to George King for the Soul. I miss you all. I was gone about a week. But I'm back now and I'm cooking some butter beans, okay? These are dry butter beans. Lima beans, what you want to call them. I'm going to cut half of this bag. I'm going to wash them up. I have washed my meat. I'm just rinsing it off. I have some cured ham, pieces of ham hock right here. This is a piece of ham hock. I have cured pigtails. I have one of those. And then I have some, some uh, small pieces of pigtail cut, cut up. Okay. I'll pour in half of this bag. Happy New Year to everyone. Okay. All you're gonna do is just wash them. What you're doing, you're looking for for a uh, split peas like that, or this color ones that you know that look like they, you know, they're a different color than than the white looking that beige. What else color do these are? Uh, pieces like that. You know, it might be with them split. You know, it's okay to cook, but I just, I try to take out most of them that I, as I can get. I know I probably missing some, but you know, that's okay. And when you cook these, y'all, you're going to cook them to the soften and to the juice on them start, start thickening up. Or is or as thick as you want it to be. Okay, I'm the type that I also, I like my beans juice thick, but I also like it kind of soupy, okay? Now that depends on you, how you like yours. Do you love, do you want your soup or not? That, and that, and that depends on how much water you keep adding to it, okay? It might not take with this just on one pot of water to cook them for you. But see, I know that I'm going to add some more water to mine because I like, I like the juice in mine. It all depends on what you like. Do you like juice or you don't? You know, I, I, you might don't like it much, but I like mine soup. I'm going to be coming back. Let's see how, um, how they're coming along. Okay. I'll put the top on these. I'm going to take them to the stove. And I'll be back. Okay. The, the, well, the ingredients that I'm going to use. I got right here a teaspoon of sugar. I'm not going to put in salt, y'all, because I'm not going to put in the oil. Not yet. Because you can have to taste them. Once they get start cooking real good you have to taste your beans to see whether or not they need salt i put a lot of meat in mine so they i probably won't need any salt okay and it also i probably won't have to add no bacon grease to it i'll have to check and see all right i'll be back okay this is what it's looking like so far about 40 minutes in way to go and get steaming up. Ok, 
Okay, click and go. I haven't added anything but the sugar. I'm not going to add anything else until it cook it cook long enough for me to taste it. Okay. All right. I'll be back. Okay, it's cooking. Now I won't add any more water because the beans some have softened up. I just let this cook now thicken it thicken up. You can see how loose it is, how thin it is, and the meat tender. And they smell so delicious. I wish I could smell it. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, this is at the stage where you're going to taste it. See, do it need anything? Because like I said, I put my water in mine. It's still got to sticking up. Right there. And I'm going to taste it. See, it's salty enough. Okay. And it don't, the meat season it. I don't need to add any salt. Okay. Okay, it's ready. I just fixed some. I'm going to give it a try. Just sit right here. These are dry butter beans. Lima beans. And they are delicious, y'all. Okay. Give them a try. Give this... If you haven't already, and see how you like it for yourself, okay? Now, I like mine. This is just a presentation. I'm going to add some uh, juice to mine because I like mine real juicy. But I did to, I did this for just for the presentation, okay? You have to fix yours the way you like it. If you like yours still, you know you add less water. If you like it soupy like I do, you add more water, okay? So... I want to thank you all for, for watching my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. And after watching this channel, you like it, give me a thumbs up, okay? And I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.